We've all heard slang terms about how quickly something can happen, as in lickety split or in a jiffy. But now there's a new one, the shortest amount of time that can be measured. Your weekend tech update is brought to you by Dell. For your small business needs, call a Dell Technologies advisor today at 877-ASK-DELL. That's 877-ASK-DELL. The term split second originated 1884 from a new kind of stopwatch with two hands, one for measuring seconds, the other for measuring fractions of a second. But scientists set out to find out just how many fractions of a second can be measured. Using the world's most powerful laser, German scientists discovered that the shortest amount of measurable time is how long it takes for light to travel across one hydrogen atom. It takes one trillionth of a billionth of a second or 0.1 followed by 20 zeros. It's called a zeptosecond. And yes, it's still a split second, except you just can't split it any further. I'm Kim Commando. The social dilemma on Netflix is shocking about how big tech really works, but you can't afford to miss what didn't make it in the documentary. We have an infinite billboard-making machine in each of our individual pockets that follows you around based on whoever the highest bidder is. For us, the public, I don't pay anything to search Google or to use Facebook or to go on Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, etc. It doesn't cost us anything, yet they're worth hundreds of billions of dollars. To say that they're just putting an ad in front of us is way too simplified of a, of, of a comment. For the last decade or so, they've really perfected this business model of extracting, taking from us, from humanity, um, in a, as a means to create their money. Catch my entire conversation with Social Dilemma director Jeff Orlowski. You have no idea just how much big tech is manipulating your mind. It's on my podcast, Tech You Should Know, now streaming on commando.com and on your favorite podcast player by searching K-O-M-A-N-D-O.